mechanic, Joe. What has happened? I was just driving this truck, when all of a sudden, it stopped moving. Morphle, morph into a bulldozer. Wow, even Morphle can't move the truck. <laughs> we glued it with the world's stickiest glue that we stole from Professor Rashid. <laughs> oh, the mud. I mean, the wrecking bandits. We are no longer the wrecking bandits. We are now the glue bandits. <laughs> <laughs> now that we have the world's stickiest glue, we can glue the mud machine back together and use it as a glue machine to cover the whole city in glue. Not in my city. Stop it right there, bandits! Tumbling test tubes! It seems that you have been glued stuck as well. This is an antidote. It stops the world's stickiest glue from working. Yay! There is more back in my laboratory, but I have no way to get it to everywhere in the city. Oh, I know. Morphle can morph into a fire truck and spray the antidote on everything that's glued stuck. We're all set. Let's dissolve this sticky situation.
no, no! Ah, it seems that the glue machine is held together with the world's stickiest glue. It will fall apart if the antidote touches it. Thank you, Morphle, Mila, and Professor Rashid. Now, I'll take these bandits to the police station. Thank <laughs> you. Morphle, I want to build the biggest sand castle ever. We should go to the desert. There is lots of sand there. Here we are. Okay, Morphle, let's start digging. But I am getting pretty thirsty. It's so hot out here. Hi, Mila and Morphle. Thank you for getting rid of the snow. The snow was made by Atmo, a new magic pet. It can control the weather, but uh, it's a bit naughty. Huh? Atmo is gone! And he's making a storm. We need to find it before its mischief gets out of hand. Oh no! I think it went that way. Let's go! The path is blocked. Not in my city.
Watch out! Stop the storm! It must not be able to hear me through the storm. Atmo! You need to... Oh, oh no! Atmo, I know you like playing with the weather, but that was dangerous. Magic letters are gone. I had every letter of the alphabet in my truck. Is that one of them, Daddy? Ah, uh, yes. It's the T for tree. Look over there in that yellow car. The C for car and the Y for yellow. Here, everything you catch with this magic pet transporter hoop will end up in the magic pet store. the two of you catch all of the letters for me, Mila? Of course, Daddy. Let's start with the A, Morphle. A, A, uh, airplane. That's right. Let's find an airplane.
Are you looking for this little guy? The U for UFO. I was on my way to Professor Rashid, but I got lost. Don't worry, we'll get you there. No, oh, tumbling test tubes. Look. It's the L for laboratory. Hmm. Maybe that also explains why there is a Q in my quantum physics experiment. Only a few more, Morphle. And I think I know just where to find them. F is for fire truck. P is for policeman. Huh? R is for race track. Do you know where we can find the Z Morphle? Uh, so that's right. Kangaroo! K! Huh! 
Hi, me land Morphle. What brings you to the zoo? We're looking for all the magic letter pets. And we only need the Z for zoo. Well, it sounds like your friends are waiting for you. <laughs> oh, Mila and Morphle. Perfect. Morphle, morph into a hot air balloon. present. Thank you, Daddy. Look, Morphle. Daddy gave me a balloon for my birthday. <laughs> oh! Oh, no! The wind swept away my birthday present. Let's go after it, Morphle. Take your binoculars, Mila. Thanks, Daddy. Bye. Bye. Hmm. Ah. Oh. I lost my hat somewhere around here, but where? at my party. Um, Mr. Cloud? Can I have that balloon, please? It was my birthday present. Your birthday present? I thought somebody must have sent it to me for my birthday. It's your birthday, too?
Poor thing. There is no one at his party. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? <sighs> huh? We're back. Hi there. <gasps> Hooray! Welcome, everybody. Happy birthday, Mr. Cloud. Happy birthday, Mila. <laughs> <laughs> where we can find a hidden treasure. It should be right here. Whoa! Whoa, whoa! Morpho! Jellyfish. Watch out, Morpho! Jellyfish sting! That's Neptune, the king of the sea. for finding us this treasure. Go after them, Morphle. <laughs> huh? Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> 
Should go. Morpho! Morph into a logging machine! Cut that tree, Morpho! Yesterday's big storm pulled out many trees. If trees aren't rooted properly, they can just fall down all of a sudden. And that can be very dangerous. <laughs> Morpho loves cutting down trees. Oh no! Look! Tumbling test tubes! Are you okay, Professor Rashid? This is my latest invention. Everything I zap with it becomes very big or very small. Ah, great! Ah, Morpho cut the tree! Morphe cut way too many trees. My beautiful forest is gone. Where are the forest animals going to live now? It will take years for these trees to grow back. Morphe, shall we? Wait! I have an idea. Professor Rashid, can we borrow your invention? How about a little story before bed? Yay! Story time! Once upon a time in a kingdom far away lived a brave king and his beautiful daughter. But then a giant climbed the tower to her bedroom window and kidnapped the princess. Boring! What? Why doesn't the giant kidnap the king for once? But who's going to save the king, then? The princess, of course! Morpho! And Morpho! Well, fine. The giant kidnapped the king and ran off with him. Help! Oh, princess, save me! <sighs> oh, no! We need to stop that giant! Morpho, morph into a suit of armor! Perfect. Now you can save the king. No, we need a sword first. Magic sword. Yeah, a magic sword. But the giant is getting away. Hmm, I know. There's a magic 
sword stuck in a rock over there. Here, let me try. <gasps> Amazing! Wow! Did you see that? Okay. So what's so magical about it? It can defeat any monster by making a rainbow. So they will be happy. What? Ooh! Oh! We're sorry, everyone. We were stealing your stuff while you were busy. Until we saw this pretty rainbow. We don't want to be bad anymore. Oh, all right. But how will you find the king now? The giant is long gone. Hmm. You could ask the dragon. Yeah, the dragon should know. No, you have to find the giant. This story is about a giant. Take my horse to visit the dragon. Well, thank you very much. Ah, <sighs> fine. To the dragon! But do you even know where the dragon lives? Well, over there, of course. Are you sure you want to go in? It sounds s s scary. The princess couldn't see anything. It was way too dark in the dragon's cave. Hello? So she decided to go out and find the giant. But first, the princess's magic sword lit up the cave. Okay, okay, nice trick. So you probably want to know where the giant lives? You should go to the mountain next door. Really? The mountain where the witch lives? So we visit her first? Okay. To the witch! Oh no. Here's the witch. Go ask her. Well, hello there. Hello, Mrs. Witch. We are looking for the giant. Can you help us find him? Yes, I definitely know where he lives. Take a few steps back, my dear. A little more, please. <laughs> Yes, the giant's castle. And there's the giant. He is so big and scary. You need to save me, princess. But you'll have to defeat me first. And then the princess made the prettiest rainbow anybody had ever seen and turned the giant from bad to good. What? And they had a tea party to celebrate. Yay, I'm saved. <sighs> I guess with that, the story is done. <sighs> that was the best story ever, Daddy. You really think so? Can you tell us another story? Well, I can tell you another one tomorrow, but now it's time to sleep. In your sleep, you will be able to dream up any story you like. Come, Morpho. Let's go on a great adventure. <sighs> Look, Morphle, like this. <laughs> Morphle too! Morphle too! Don't worry, Morphle. You'll get the hang of it. But you'll never be as good as this little guy. Meet Boba, our newest magic pet. Boba loves blowing bubbles. He tends to 
bubble over with joy from it. <laughs> Whoa! See? That looks like fun. Ah. Whee! <laughs> um, Boba, this is high enough. To something big. Ah! 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 Now, Morpho, save Mila. Mila. Uh oh. What is? <laughs> ah! Help! Help me! of problems. whether I'd see my car again. <laughs> well, Boba, next time you bubble over, please don't take it so literally. We need 
too fast. One more to go, Morpho. By now, the robot sharks must have scared away all the people from the beach. <laughs> yeah, so now we can steal all their towels. I can't believe Professor Rashid fell for it. The idea that we actually wanted these robots in order to research sharks. And that he made them in exchange for just one egg sandwich. <laughs> Speaking of which, where are our robot sharks? <gasps> Look out, Morpho! Bandit! Not those two again. Morpho! Become a big shark, too! <laughs> You're no match for our robot! Let's get him, Yorn! Now more flags, Morpho! to get out of here. Look, Stein, our robot sharks have come to save us. Those are not robot sharks, Yorn. Those are real sharks. Help! Help! an important lesson today. Yeah, real sharks are dangerous. So we shouldn't scare people while dressed like sharks? Exactly. Let's build a big sand castle. Morpho, morph into a digger. Okay, so this is Aquily. Its magic powers allow it to swim wherever he wants, even if there's no water there. Yes, exactly what we were looking for. <laughs> oh, shh, shh. Water stream right into town. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I. Finally, we can cause mischief away from the sea. Steal all the toys we want! <laughs> and we can steal all the ice cream we want! <sighs> I love ice cream. We 
can now even smash sand castles that are not on the beach. <laughs> Ship through the city. Morphle, morph into a boat, too. Mila, Morphle, those pirates have Aquily. Use the magic pet transporter who. Aquily? Let's see what our heroes, Mila and Marvel, have to say. 
You caught the bandits once again. You must be super excited. Yeah. Morphle can do anything. He's the best magic pet ever. Aww. Close up on the emotions. This was Charlotte's Scoop for PRY News. Milan Morphle, can you help? My ball is stuck on the roof. Of course. Morphle, morph into a fire truck. Mila and Morphle just helped this boy get back his ball. The one thing that makes him happiest. Tell the audience, how does that make you feel? Uh, okay, I guess. Oh, I can't wait to see what they will do next. Please tell the viewers all about what you are doing right now. We are setting the table. Wow, setting the table and setting a great example for kids all over the world. <sighs> ah! uh, not again. What are you going to do today? We're not going to do anything today. Morphle, morph into a race car. Wait! Oh, no! Morphle, go faster! Morph into a A speedboat! Exciting! When did you first develop your deep love for the ocean? How did you... Uh, never mind. Morphle, morph into an airplane! Whew. Surely she can't follow us into the air. Wait! I still have more questions to ask you! Oh, no! Morphle, we need to help her! Thank you for saving me, Mila and Morphle. If you hadn't followed us, this wouldn't have happened. I hope you learned your lesson. I sure did. That was spectacular! I, for one, can't wait to see what Mila and Morphle will do tomorrow. Oh, no. No, <laughs> three of my poor little sheep went missing. <laughs> Morphle and I can help you find them. Morphle, let's go. Hey, sheep, it's time to go home. into a flying tractor.
Jolly fat. More ice cream. Jolly Fan is making so much ice cream. Oh, I don't know what to do with it all. Yeah, and it's not healthy for Morphle. We should go out and find a human companion for the Jolly Fan. Okay, Jolly Fan. Show Geraldo what you can do. So, what do you say? Do you want to be the Jolly Fan's human companion? No, 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 no. This is too easy. Geraldo's gelatos is not just some ice cream factory. I am an artist. Hmm. Oh. Look, there's a fire over there. But Firefighter Gerbin is running out of water. And Morphle still can't morph because he ate too much ice cream. Jolly Fan, use your ice cream to put out the fire. Was amazing. You're a real hero. A hero? <laughs> it will take me days to clean up this mess. Oh, I think Mr. Vanderboos is right. Hmm. I'm sorry that we couldn't find a fit human companion for you, but don't worry. You will always have a place here at the Magic Pet Store. Hello? Hello? Hi there. I'm looking for a Magic Pet to cheer up the kids at the Children's Hospital.
Center.